Hello everyone, Pretzel here again. This is part 12 now of our Let's Play of Might and Magic 6. We are still in the Temple of Ba, but I think we're almost near the end. We've cleared the big room with the altar where the gazillion skeleton spawn and we're now running around at about on the sides here where I think we can open a chest somewhere but not on this side I have zero memory of this place. Is locked. You're shitting me. Okay. Maybe we should go to the center. Uh, to that center room that was locked earlier. Lots of running about here. All right. Door clicks. Now the other side. Door clicks. You have to spell news with this door. In this room. Got it. There we go. Now we have a bathhouse key. Hopefully, the last one. Truthless, mm. ah. we have weakness. I'm not gonna take it along with me this time. Mm. Aha. Uh, 150, I'll do that. Oh. And again, we have skeletons. We need to rest somewhere. Let's get out. That was a bit close. I kind of forgot there were mobs spawning, but okay. We're not going to be dealt with that easily. Even though we get a lot. A flag from those clerics. We just have to hit a, a breach here. Okay, something like that. There's more mobs coming. Also have to take into account the fireball. 
Yeah. Casualty. Let's go. Well, at least you can say is that this is a lot of experience. Excuse me. Okay. Um get a rest in get another blast off and re enter the fray. Don't think there's too many mobs left, but all those annoying clerics. Push over if you can get in green. Um, if you can get in blue. A few more of these. We have to 
We have to run back, all the way back. Back to the top. Back into that long hallway. Hopefully for the last time now. Um, nope, it's the other way. We want to get into this passage right here. Oh, there f might be another cave left too. Crap. I thought I was done. Well, let's see how far that key will take us. The door is locked, okay. That's not all that funny. Not entirely sure where I should be going then. But I'll give it a go to Ah, yeah. Hidden in plain sight. I've missed this. That's entirely my fault. Okay. More skeletons? Yep. So you know as many as before. Oh, clerics. I don't like clerics. Actually, I don't like anything that has a ranged attack on me. Out. That too. Come on, come on. Got another. A bunch behind them. Probably not the best plan. Cutlass. I don't know. It's one of the good ones too. Sadly, no damage bonus. I would like to share my prospects of the not too distant future, I hope. I would very much like to get out of this dungeon. <laughs> That's uh, something to look forward to. Okay. 
okay. I'm going to rest again. Buff up to the teeth. Get our bless running. And move in. When you simply can't or won't deal with any more clerics, run in and lead. Like I was looking at the wrong side. You want to prioritize your fire on those swords. Oh, they're so bloody fast. You know, fuck it. I'm just gonna stick here. Oh, that was too easy. There. Nothing there. Nothing in there. Trash heaps or nothing. That was too easy. So this is done too. Are these the last of the skeletons in this? Amazingly starting to get boring dungeon. Aha. Shield might be useful. Boring is relative, of course. But you can get. Uh, well, sometimes you can just spend 30 minutes in the dungeon and you've seen it, but you still have to plow on, take another half hour, maybe another hour. It just happens, you know? <sighs> Stone skin, we're getting the good ones here. Want to start using them soon too. Okay, so I haven't been. Oh, I haven't been over there. There is another one up top here, another secret room. Back to the top floor we go. Just so he's in green again. In Might and Magic 8 you actually have a regeneration skill that restores hit points over time. And if you're a, I think a lizard character or a dragon character, I'm not sure if you can play a lizard. It's dragon probably. But they look like lizards, and they are big lizards. Technically. But anyway, that skill is fairly useful. Kind of miss that here. But I think there you can get rings with uh, regenerate hit points over time, but it's only a slight amount. We'll have to use enchant item on rings. Maybe get some if, a few in for that. This door is locked too. Okay, now I'm not really sure what I should be doing then. Hmm.
Okay. I suppose I've missed something. A bathhouse key. A bathhouse key. This isn't a bathhouse. Maybe... Huh. Maybe it's one of these rooms. Like here, looks like another room. Yeah, I'll try that. I kind of want to refrain from looking too much... Too much stuff up. But I also want to kind of finish this dungeon. Yeah, that was it, of course. Got it. And another key. Treasure room key. That does sound like the key we need. <sighs> Aha. Yeah. Aha. Aha. Oh, that's for light. Aha. Okay. Uh, we have a speed ring. Excuse me. And we have a might ring. Actually, I'm gonna give this one to the clerk. Yes, so she can have a bit of a bonus. Yeah, that was a lot of running around. They scared the bejesus out of me. And she got cursed. The spell failed. Let's get out of the clear here. There we go. Okay. Totally forgot those skeletons would spawn. Ran in like a noob. Okay. Get some less action going. I wonder where those last mobs went. Oh, that is a crack. Can't be anything else. Okay. So, for the third or the fourth time, I mean, Probably the last time now we go up. Let's get that wizard in green.
I hope we have the right side. But maybe those those bo both those doors open from the same key. Yeah. This one opens at least. Now I should take into account that there will spawn mobs behind me. So I'll rest here. Just in case. I'll bless up. Got it. We have the chimes. Alright. That's what we came here for. Aha. So do we have skeletons here? Nope. Okay. Just take the shortcuts. We're gonna check what's on the other side. Maybe we get lucky. Speaking of which, lucky day on her. I think, but I'm not entirely sure that luck also improves the skills you practice, so she gets a luck bonus on her disarm skill, that's always very welcome. And that door is not locked anymore. Oh baby, if this is all gold, yep. Totally forgot about this, but I'm not. I'm not sad about it. Let's check how many we get. I think we started on 17,000. Yeah, that's uh, almost 10,000 gold here. And we have the chimes, so that was worth it after all. Looking about like an ass. Looking about for those secret doors running around like an idiot. But it paid off. Our party has a very decent amount of cash reserve. We can probably buy some more expensive spells now, maybe some more expensive gear. Please don't hurt me that much anymore now. They appear to be coming from inside the mountain. I actually never tire from that sound of those followers dying. Quite literally, never. Thank you. 
sometimes the best defense is a good offense. So that's what we're doing here. We want to focus on the archers, that's the only mob that can really hurt you now. All these, all the rest. They can't hurt you much. There comes a time where you have to just clear an area to move freely, and that's what I just did here. There's uh, another dungeon here. We won't enter that uh, just yet. I think we've had enough. What we need now is a lot of training. And uh, we'll spend quite a sum of gold, I suppose. I think this is Nurgle's Cavern. And we won't need to be here for another while. There we go, it's truly clear now. The entire south of Iron Fist. Ah, uh, this dungeon is... Oh, the Dragoon Caverns, I was actually wrong. I do have to be here. But not yet. We are going to wrap up here get our gold secured, food stashes up train some skills, get rid of these items a lot of items and then two quests free haven Oh, this is the Greetings and yeah. That's uh, the next quest we'll do. And that's pretty much most of the easy ones done. <laughs> we have drunk from the fountain a while ago, but we still have to uh, hand in the quest. So that's another bunch of experience. Oh man, I'm looking forward to that. That's always the, my most favorite moments in this game, leveling up, choosing skills, and see what monsters you can own that time, the time around. We can actually buy that stuff now, except that one. That's a very nice one, of the golem. Two of them, actually. Oh, now that's nice. That's got sorcerer written all over it. <sighs> Should I buy it? Should I buy it? Yeah, let's buy it. Come on, let's buy it. There's no room. Yeah, I definitely should buy it. These have more armor, but. Half damage from missile attacks, that's... You know what, I'm not going to. Fuck it. I'll wait. Back. 
Greetings and salutations. Find his weapons in the land. I don't know. Stuff here that needs to be identified. Sold preferably. More stuff? I don't Ooh. know. Ah. It's a fifty gold bow. It's not gonna help us out. Hide his weapons in the land. Come on in. Always resists. It worked. Of course it worked. What do you take me for? Cure Paralysis, yes, Charm, yes, Meditation, remove here, we have that one, Precision, Mind Blast, okay, yes, okay, yes, let's start taking care of, we have Heroism, we don't have Guardian Angel, that's expensive, Healing touch. First aid now. Yes. Let's see what the difference is. Um Healing touch is 5 to 9 hit points of damage healed, and first aid is 7 hit points base. That's 5 to 9, so potentially less, and this also costs less. Speed, protection from poison, cure poison, finally cure poison. Yes, 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 indeed. That's very good. We don't have harm. Okay. There we go. It's a few spells sorted. Should get our hands on enchant item too now. Thanks. Come again. Okay. Greetings. Greetings. Greetings and salutations. It's probably a good idea to invest in um, I forgot was it what I was about to say. Yeah, probably in general a good idea to invest in uh, some elemental spells too. But that will be for the next video, I think. We have 23k gold. We have another dungeon in the vicinity to clear. We can obviously level at least three more levels. So we should really think on what we want to do, maybe by meditation on uh, our casters, bodybuilding on night, or 
maybe we should buy learning first, get some more experience in that way. Yeah, lots of stuff to think about. So, we'll decide on those things in the next video. Again, thanks for watching, and until the next one.